that's a real event to film because Oli is preparing the coffee. <laughs> You're doing great. You're doing great, nearly. You can do it. Hi, I'm Lavi. And I'm Oli. And this is our hero, Bumblebee. Together, we are attempting a Guinness World Record to become the youngest pair to circumnavigate the globe by, by motorcycle. motorcycle. Join us for season three here in South America. Good morning world, welcome back to the channel. It's day number 281 on our circumnavigation around the globe by motorcycle. Good morning, Nikos. Good morning. Good morning, Bumblebee. We're here just camping next to the river Perquilacuen, just off of the route of five in Chile. Yes, and today it's a really exciting day because we will make it to Santiago. Yes. <laughs> and that means we have ridden 16,000 miles on these tires without a puncture, without any issues, which is absolutely crazy. But the tires are at its end, 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 end. It's so close and I'm Down really- Down to half a mil of treads. Absolutely. And I'm really excited that we can finally replace them and also replace our chain and our sprockets. I mean, it's time to get Bumblebee a new service, to get Bumblebee road ready again. So let me show you guys the route for today. So unfortunately, as this is a map of Argentina, I can't show you exactly where we are, but we're around the level of Ranquil del Norte, about here somewhere. And today we're gonna to be heading up on the Ruta 5 highway, which comes back on the map here and following that up to Santiago. So we have about 250 miles and it's already 8.30, so better hit the road, let's go. Let's go. Rock and roll. <laughs> oh, all fired up. Right, we gotta get out of this little camping spot, straight into some off-road maneuvers, through the bush. <laughs> Easy. Like I said before, I've been watching a lot of Dakar rally videos recently. <laughs> now you're inspired, yeah? <laughs> now I'm like, hold on a minute, it doesn't look so difficult. Wait, was it left or right here? Oh, I don't know. I think it was this way. Okay. Whee! Whee! <laughs> yeah, this little area is sort of a little municipal camping area by the river here. And a lot of locals are using this area as well, having barbecues, but also dumping a lot of rubbish. And now to the uh, left here. Ah, yeah. Whoa, look at this bit. Okay. <laughs> Just gotta hold on a minute. Okay. Let's do it. Woo! Woo! From Dakar to highway. 226 miles to Santiago. And then, Bumblebee will be a whole new motorbike. Today's ride will actually be our last ride with Nikos on this journey. Ooh. Yeah, it was really cool that we could meet him again here and ride together and we might see him again in Europe. <laughs> yeah, his plan now is to head from Santiago back over to Brazil, back to where he's from, Florianopolis, because he's just not confident in his Tenere at the moment and doesn't want to push it any further north, which is understandable. And he's actually planning on going to Europe and buying a bike over there and riding around Europe here this year. So you never know, he might actually join us for a section in Europe. Yes, maybe we can catch up like in Turkey. Yeah, that would be crazy to ride with him in Brazil, ride with him in Chile, <laughs> Argentina, and then ride with him over in Turkey. Oh my yeah. God. <laughs> nice. Yeah, it will be a surprise. Let's see, hey? Yep, Nikos, this won't be the last ride. That's for sure. This guy's bringing his horse to the petrol station. Something is wrong here, hey? Hello. <laughs> oh, <Aww>, hello. <laughs> it's not every day you see a horse on a highway.
Rear I haven't seen Rear Chronicles in ages. I know, I know, I miss them. I miss them too. It's always lovely to have their presence all around the sides of the road and you could be, hello Granico, hello Granico. <laughs> it looks like we've entered the wine region of Chile now. We've got vineyards on this side, we've got vineyards on this side. We have advertising for wine just ahead here. <laughs> oh yeah, look, Gato. Ah, look, it just said on the sign, Bienvenidos a Ruta de Vino. Ah, look. So, welcome to the wine route. Yeah, very nice, very nice helmet hair. <laughs> We're just stopping for a break here at a service station and uh, there's a guy selling tortas over here. I'm not sure what a torta is. Tortas. Hmm. I just looked up the translation. Torta means cake. So it's just sweet stuff over there actually. Oh, okay. So maybe we'll have a look in here, see what they got. And for those of you who are wondering what 16,000 miles or nearly 16,000 miles looks like on a rear tire or a Dunlop Trail Max Mission tire, this is what we've got. See? This is what it started at. Look at the sides. Nice deep grooves. And now we're down to probably what? A mill. <laughs> a mill. Oh. These tires are absolutely the best tires in the world. Look at that. 16,000 miles. Found some empanadas. <laughs> and Nikos has empanada. Empanada and a sandwich. And also, Lavi's cooking up a little side for us <laughs> some chickpeas with some tomato. And um, oh, and some of that soy protein mince that we picked up in Cholila. Yes, pretty easy. Just everything in the pot, heat it up, and ready to go. It's amazing. Mm. Beautiful. And empanadas. This one is um, mushroom cheese, champignon queso, empanada. Amazing. I tried to stuff some mince and chickpeas in there, enhancing it. Amazing. It's recording 35 degrees. Man! Yeah, it's getting hotter and hotter and hotter as we're getting further north. But I mean, this is a little bit ridiculous now. It's getting there. Whew. Anyway, 35 miles from Santiago away now. So we are very, very close. Yes. The, la <laughs> Woo! the landscape is absolutely stunning. We have this barren hills here with some bushes on and the color is like sort of red. It's so cool here. I mean, all around us, it's just, it's just stunning. But yeah, I can feel the heat. Yeah, we're going to be stopping for a rest pretty soon. Our last one before Santiago. But we've done really well so far, 192 miles already today and it's nearly 3 o'clock so doing amazingly well. We just bought this little treat here from a street seller here at the payage we were on and I really want to try them now. <laughs> it's like some sort of wafers, right? Yeah, I think wafers filled with uh, some caramel or something. Beautiful, we'll try them at the next break. Yeah, it was like a pound for 20. Oh. Switching lanes. 
Oh no, it's 15. 15 are inside here for one pound, so it's a quite a good deal. <laughs> Bye Nikos! <laughs> so it's time for us to head different ways. But it's been an absolutely awesome adventure together. We did some amazing moto camping. Spectacular moto camping actually. Nikos, we see you're in Turkey! So now we're about nine miles from an Airbnb that we've booked in the city. And we're really starting to get in the city now. And it is really, really hot here. 32 degrees now the sun is blaring down so I am definitely ready to get to the accommodation and get all this clothes off oh yes me too <laughs> and 0 0.6 to the uh, right okay yeah to the right here okay Oh, look at those mountains up ahead. Very cool. Mountains all around the city. Okay, go to the right here. And then it's like so um, zero, 0 0.2. A little bit more, just a tiny bit more. Two, three, two, three. Ah, yeah, I see. Okay. Hola. Hola. Aha! Down? Yeah, I think so. Is it ramp, no? Yeah. Oh. 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 oh look at this. Oh. You think on this level or the next? Oh. <laughs> Whoa, we we're like really underground. Ah, I see him. Okay. Whee. Good evening, guys. We made it. Happy and alive. Yes. Woo, Santiago, we are here. <laughs> I cannot believe that we made it here to Santiago. I can't believe that we're finally here. Even Cholila four days ago feels like a lifetime ago already. <laughs> I mean, it was so many miles and so much of that highway, Ruta 5. Whew. And then the whole time thinking, is Bumblebee gonna make it? Are the tires, that mill tread getting lower and smaller and smaller and smaller? Oh, I'm so pleased that we made it in one piece. Bumblebee gets a nice service in two days, new tires, it will be a new bike for a new adventure. <laughs> yes, Santiago was a bit of a checkpoint for us. It was all about getting here so that we can get everything sorted and then hit the road for the next leg. But we hit the jackpot with this Airbnb Right now, we are on the 16th floor, on the rooftop of this apartment. Look at this. Whoa. And not only that, but this apartment block has a gym, has a sauna, and on the other side, a rooftop swimming pool. <laughs> what? What? What is this? I think we have to stay forever. It's like we get like a five-star hotel, <laughs> yeah. but we just booked a room on Airbnb. Airbnb, we love you. As sometimes it works out really, really well. I'm super glad to be here. And now we can just chill, relax for a bit and jump in the pool. Yes, and that's it for us today. At the end, we did 290 miles and we hope you enjoyed the video. If so, please give us a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, share the video with your friends and family comment below and you can also join our membership program here on YouTube if you want to support us and we will see you next time!
It's about 250 miles to Santiago and it's already 8.30, so better hit the road, let's go. Wait, wait, because you, 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 you poked me in the eye. I'm sorry! <laughs>